only in second standard ah. today i am going to show you an experiment of a air so for that you need a tissue a glass and a bowl filled with water take the tissue do it like this now put it in the glass yeah and remember it should you should fit it so tight that even if we twist it upside down it doesn't fall and don't re and remember to ensure it's it doesn't fall now flip the glass and slowly and gently straight put it in the water if it be lain also on straight then it will be ruined so be so now let's leave it for a little bit time okay now let's take up it Let's check what happened to the tissue. Oh, it's dry. But how? You get the answer later. First, now put it again. Now don't forget to ensure it doesn't fall. Again, put it in the water. And slow and slow, gentle and straight like the last time. Now let's try to tilt it. Wow! See bubbles. Okay. Now let's take the glass up. Let's check what happened to the tissue. Wet. See, water is coming out. But how? In the first time, the tissue was dry. But in the second time, the tissue is wet. That's because the glass has two things in it: the tissue and air. So when we put the glass inside the water. Uh, a occupy space a is in the glass and water has no space to enter the glass because a is already in and so when we tilt the glass a has space to go out from the glass and comes in the shape of bubbles and and water has space to enter the glass and make the tissue wet that teaches that uh, air occupies space thank you for watching and please don't forget to like and subscribe the video bye